Hello everyone, I am Be Better Gamer. Welcome to Be Better Gamer Wrestling. This channel is dedicated to the classic series of N64 wrestling games developed by Aki Core, WCW NW Revenge, WCW vs NW World Tour, Virtual Pro Wrestling 64, Virtual Pro Wrestling 2, WrestleMania 2000, and WWF No Mercy, which is today's video. And I am bringing to you my first ever subscriber call video. I had a little project where every 50 new subscribers reached, I will upload a video of, of a call that one of my subscribers made. And today I am going to be doing the first call. His name is Kabuki Demon. And he was sent in by subscriber Flyabusa. This is to celebrate my channel hitting 550 subscribers super excited about that super excited about all the support and super excited to be playing as kabuki demon once again sent in by flyabusa obviously flyabusa taking it from hayabusa he's a big fan of hayabusa flyabusa has definitely many nods to hayabusa the wrestler one of my personal favorites too i uh Hopefully one day I'll get to do some Virtual Pro Wrestling 2 videos focused on Hayabusa, but there's my call, Be Better Gamer, coming in. And like I said, if you send me your calls, your creator wrestlers, um, after every 50 subscribers, I will upload a video where I will use your, your, your call, okay, against mine. I'll beat the crap out of my <laughs> Be Better Gamer call. There I go, using some strong martial arts striking moves by Kabuki Demon. And so, yeah, if you want to go ahead and take, be a part of that, you can click on the link below. I have the video description in the link below of what you need to do to submit your call. And also, um... A link to the document that you're gonna need to send in to submit your call. So here we go, uh, Kabuki Demon countering the back grapple there, running back face smash. Um, Flyabusa, he sent me a few notes when he sent me his call. He said, you know, he's been playing the Aki games since World Tour '97. Awesome, so have I. That's great. That's great to hear. Long time listener first time caller <laughs> uh, kabuki demon is well versed in kung fu and ridiculously unbalanced in a strong way for those times when the computer ai is super cheap and he is very strong i have to admit he's got like the the top tier stats of you know fast movement speed expert grappling and the longest jumping distance. I mean, that's top tier right there if we want to talk No Mercy competitive cause. Uh, he says that the strong front attack directions, you know, B and the strong attack A and B, those are advancing attacks. He uses them to cover ground on an opponent who is far away. And um, he likes to think of it as free movement. It's a very interesting way to think about that. I mean, there's a lot of moves in No Mercy that definitely allow you to cover a lot of ground. And they allow you to move fast enough to interrupt your opponent. Boom, there's the Farouk side slam. You know, when he was talking about his character being overpowered, giving the Farouk side slam as a running, uh, as an Irish whip grapple, I should say, a weak Irish whip grapple. Very cool. Um, and then he also says that the only thing he wishes No Mercy had was two level specials like Virtual Pro Wrestling 2 and Masks. There I go with the hitting him with the Cobra Clutch back suplex special. And there's the ultimate punching. Uh, that's actually a, a submission special as well. I had to unlock a lot of stuff to create this Kabuki Demon. You know, as I've been going through the Let's Plays, I still don't have a ton of money in the SmackDown Mall. And I, un I had to unlock his outfit. Boom, hitting the big S.A. Rios Moonsault. One of the best moonsault animations in my opinion of the whole series um but yeah i had to unlock the ultimate punching uh you're gonna probably see me later i'm gonna do the russian neck drop special i had to unlock the kabuki demons uh upper body attire i don't lock a, a lot of stuff to um play as this kabuki demon but that's really cool i mean i was gonna get to that stuff anyway so this just kind of like lit a fire you know, and I'm definitely foreshadowing uh, something that's going to happen later on. But definitely lift the fire under my butt to go ahead and unlock these moves and stuff. So I'm just dominating the Be Better Gamer Wrestling call right now. He does not know what to do with him. He's grabbing his head. Just dropped him on his head with that big neck drop. Boom, Dragon Suplex. Myself, I am a big fan of the Dragon Suplex. I'm so glad to see that. He's got a lot of strong... What I like about this call is that he's got a lot of strong grapples. You know, he's got... Two powerbomb pins, 
you know, he's got the praying power bomb and the Jericho triple power bomb. And then he's also got a snap power bomb. He's got a choke slam. He's got a great back grapples. He saw that neck drop suplex. He's got a great, uh, I think it's German suplex 0-2. Here we go, I'm about to get fancy. Bam, high flying. You can't, can't be a martial artist and not fly out the ring, right? He's got that spinning corkscrew, corkscrew attack. Here we go. I wanted to do this. Bam, Harlem hangover to the outside. Love that. Love that he put that in there. Harlem hangover, one of my favorite moves. You know, that flipping leg drop. Made famous, made infamous by Booker T. Uh, but a lot of other people did. I think Two Cold Scorpio had a really pretty one as well. Here we go. I'm going to set him up. What am I going to set him up for this time? Oh, yeah, the running, the, the Irish whip. He throws him up. Bam, ace cutter, diamond cutter, whatever you want to call it. In the game, they call it. Uh, press three quarters neck breaker, which I think is funny. Here we go. The release German suplex from the ground position. Or I mean, I'm sorry, that's not the release German suplex. That was the uh, the 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 uh, oh man, what is it called? The Russian neck drop. I wanted to do the release German suplex, but I didn't get to his legs in time. Boom, counter mini chop. So when Flyabusa was talking about his character being overpowered, I do think that when you counter, boom, big German suplex, when you do counter into one of those automatic moves, that definitely puts you at a power advantage against any opponent, not just a computer. But, you know, if you're playing against someone and you're really good at countering punches, I mean, that slows down all momentum for your opponent when you counter into, like, you know, Kabuki Demon does into those mini chops. Or if you counter into, like, one of the falling arm breakers or things like that. He also set his counter settings to martial arts. So I don't know if I did any really strong counters in the air that you can see that. Boom, there we go. Pick him up. The released German suplex from the lower leg submission. He's very, he is very powerful. I've got to say, I felt, I felt comfortable playing as Kabuki Demon. I did a few matches before this video, and here we go. Here's the money shot right here. Bam, the mist, the Frankensteiner with the mist. That's that Kabuki Demon play. I had a, I had a, you know, I had a Keje Mudo, you know, great Muda slash Kane kind of vibe, you know, with Kabuki Demon. He's definitely big and menacing like Kane. You know, he's got the Kane mask, but obviously. He put the Kane mask because, you know, he wishes WWF No Mercy had the masks, you know, that you could create just like in Virtual Pro Wrestling 2. Oh, I wish that too, man. I, I That's one of the biggest features that I do not know why they did not put into uh, WWF No Mercy. And then you're stuck really with just a Kane mask and some face paint, you know. So if you want to make mask wrestlers, there's not a whole lot of options in this game. Meanwhile, Virtual Pro Wrestling 2 had a bunch of masks that you could use and you could use different little settings on it and combine different styles. It was great, man. So I, I don't know. Here we go. Here's another great thing that I think he did. I'm trying to do it in this video. Uh, it's going to take me a little bit to do it. But he's got that praying rope walk uh, with Kabuki Demon. And he set it as the weak grapple. So when you grab them, it's a lot easier to do that move because it's such a cool looking move. So I think that was very smart that he did that and it really helps uh you know it just really helps pull off that move you know what i mean like because you don't want to be just spending the whole time there there we go with a rear naked choke from behind outside tapping out tapping out outside but there's you know there's not uh it's not hardcore rules so you know that just brings his meter down allows me to roll him back in the ring so yeah so while i try to do that irish uh that uh praying mantis rope walk um let me see, is this, yeah, this is it? Oh, there we go, here it is. There it is, such an awesome move. For a while, I remember in uh, Virtual Pro Wrestling 2 is when I first saw this move. You know, they didn't have that move in, in WrestleMania 2000, so for the longest time, my character had that in Virtual Pro Wrestling 2, and I did the same thing. I put it as the weak grapple because it was a lot easier to do, and it was such a cool move. You know, you don't want to just, like, not be able to do it all the time, and doing strong grapples is really hard from the apron. There you go, big clothesline. Gonna do the Phoenix Splash. Get that tribute to Hayabusa going. Obviously, you know, his name is Flyabusa. Give him the Hayabusa. Hayabusa, obviously the creator of the Phoenix Splash. And here we go. The big finish. Bam! The big fireball. I love that. I love the big fireball from Kabuki Demon. Put it away, Be Better Gamer. Let's be honest. Be Better Gamer did not have a chance. Kabuki Demon, too strong, too powerful, too fast. So many moves to put you away, but then, you know, he's got that mystical element about him when he could throw a fireball in your face. Boom, let's get, let's get that replay. Oh, I love it. Thank you so much, Flyabusa, for being the first person 
to send your creative wrestler to my channel so that after you know I got my next 50 subscribers from reaching 500 you were able to get your video up first so here we go another 50 subscribers I'll do another subscriber call video so when I reach 600 that'll be the next one when I reach 650 that'll be number three and so on and so forth as my channel grows you know I'm aware that it's because of you the subscribers that do it so I want to give something back and that's why I started this whole little project so submit your calls to me and you can have a video just like this where I will play as your creative wrestler and dominate my own and uh, remember original calls original calls only I'm not looking for calls of wrestlers that already exist you know original calls your imagination you know be creative really go all out give me your best call possible and yeah that's that's it so I hope you enjoyed this t video I hope I did Kabuki Demon Justice Flyabusa and yeah until next time keep watching all the wrestling thank you